Look who's here. We're in the house. The chef. Uh, we're in the house. It's official. Uh -huh. I'm back. How's it feel, baby? It feels like a brand new bag of money. Uh. <laughs> Hey, what's up everyone? Shane here. So I recently had the Fight Tips coaches over this week where we discussed the recent news of Demetrius Johnson leaving the UFC and signing with one championship and how the different rule set in one changes the game for strikers versus wrestlers. I mean, that knee to the head changed the game for wrestlers too. Uh, like, if I get you the front headlock, I'll end your life. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wait, what are you talking about? If, if... Like, you know, in, in one FC, they allow you to knee on the head. On the ground. On the ground. Even if my hand's down? At any time in life, you're allowed to knee your opponent. <laughs> knee on the ground. No. No. Yeah. So show me what you're talking about. So any so I'm man, saying, like, if someone was to shoot him, yeah, just fake here, boom. I'm here in the front headlock. I can knee you. Come to the ground. I can knee you. 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 I can. And this is all wrestler time. Right. So as I'm going around and you're trying to figure out life, I'm just going to go. Fuck. 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 Uh, it's like, so it's yeah. real fighting. That's like that's yeah. real. That's yeah. real as it gets. Yeah. Talk about you. It's as real but, as it gets. Like, yeah, it's Oops. as real as it gets. But like from a wrestler's perspective, that changes. That absolutely changes the game for me. I gotta ask, what's your take on uh, Khabib? I loved it. Yeah. Come on. Tell me. Tell me what you really think, though, man. I knew that that was gonna happen on tape. I called the entire fight like it was going to happen. What about the overhand that dropped him? Wrestler overhand. Yeah. Fake the shot. Wrestler fake overhand. Shot. It's, it's, shot. It's, it's afraid of the shot. Fe so fear for the Just don't pause on me. And that shit is over. And you know how he's like hands low already yeah. anyway, too. Yeah. And oh, he no. does this like, you know, he, he does the like look away chin thing. Yeah. Where it's like, it's not like a duck and roll. It's like a, a freeze. Oh, I'm about to hit you and then you get smacked. So, mm. you know, but like styles make matchups, right? And everything about MMA is about styles and matchups. Yeah, man. Mm. Therefore, people in different organizations make their matchups for styles, for excitement, or for winners, or for losers. That's why there is a red and a B, a blue side. There is an A and a B mm. corner. They fight 10 times, Connor and Khabib. Does Connor ever win? Connor knocks him out three times, maybe. Hmm. I agree. That's, yeah, that's, that's fair. If you saw this time, Connor's wrestling was not bad. It was not no, bad at all. No, as a wrestler, so I saw a lot of hip thing. I saw a lot of wrestling from Connor that I'm like, yo. Interesting. Yo. Yo. Wow. Hey. Hey. But were you impressed at all with any of his striking? Because he did not Connor get. Connor's striking? A, he, I didn't see I'm, a lick, I'm not looking at him from striking there. I know. I, know, <laughs> you know, I, I know see him not. strike. I'm just like, you doing what you do. Listen, Khabib Connor 2, it might go differently simply because the wrestling won't be as he felt everything. He's got it. Mm -hmm. he, you know, it's like it's, it's familiarity. So he's got that. But also, the, the defense. There was a knee that landed. Oh, he had a, had he had an in second bleep. Like if he's a wrestler, he lands it because his reaction time. And you know how he says when he beat Aldo, how he, he was saying after precision beats power every time. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. There was a time where Connor was was standing here like this doing this thing, and he rotated right into like a bull, and it whoop, yeah. and got caught here. And now started wrestling. let me ask you this, and feel free to say I'm not answering that. But in the in the media workout. Connor was practicing mm -hmm. the flying knee yes. and the rear uppercut. Absolutely. I think the rear uppercut is much safer mm -hmm. when someone's shooting a takedown in on you. Yes. As a wrestler and someone who shoots double legs, mm -hmm. is that something that you're very wary of and it's kind of like your kryptonite? No, only because I know, like I teach my guys and I take, we go towards the lead leg. We don't go towards the rear leg. You only go towards the rear leg if you're hurt and all that shit and that's how you get hurt. I always shoot no matter where we're going. I'm good enough to change my lead leg, confuse you enough to shoot my head to the lead leg side. Would it be smart uh -huh. to go with a lead uppercut? Good luck. <laughs> Using your lead uppercut to knock me out as I'm running my body through your I want to see that a little bit. That's what, I so, mean, yeah, so help when down. I go, when I go, yeah, yeah, yeah. so when I'm going shot to this side, I'm going here, right. boom, uh -huh. right through that. You know, and that's his, oh, that him and his time, and down. that's not enough. To, you know what I'm saying? Get a little arm he would here. have to come here. Boom! You would have to have, have you'd have to have square hips. If, if I'm in a bladed stance, I'd have to load and then right. throw. Not only arm that, I'm just like this. Right. It's going to be my ear to his hip and his fist to my right. face, right. and it's got to be hard enough to stop my NCAA ass. Which which is very too. very very I'm not I'm not gonna say anything about wrestler versus boxer, but my body's behind what I'm doing. 
All I got is but, shoulder, maybe. And, may, and maybe a little hit, but I'm coming like, time here. this is what I do. You know what I'm saying? Plus, I'm going, okay, when when, when is it coming? So, so You know yeah. what I'm saying? I mean, maybe it'd be better for him to sweep his leg back and hit with the rear hand. Yes. Like, if you're coming in here, you yes. have to do one of those. Oh, then, that's especially when, if you're shooting on this, uh, and I can uh, that's when it's more leg. vicious. I and that's, that's, when, that. that's when the lead leg becomes the rear leg, and that's why I don't do it originally. So if I was to do it originally, like we just talked about, Going towards the rear way. leg, instead of leading leg here, it's just just straight into that punch. Boom. He's got enough time for me to come ah. across for him to load up and say, nah, nah, nah. Yeah. Yeah. Or, nah, nah. Boom. Or, bah. you know what I mean? That's right. why I don't go on this line. Right. I stay away from that line with all costs. Even if I want to get my head on this side, I'll come back to this line. I I'm see. right back to this I leg. See. Whether it's with this hand or this hand, but I always throw before I go. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's that's the real. Hey, riddle! I throw before I go because I'm a wrestler. I'm an evolving wrestler. Like I said, I'm not just going to be the NCAA come off the mat. I'm going to be this guy. Whoa! There it is. Regardless, though, I'm not going to be this guy here. Hmm. I'm now. Yeah. Never. Wait, what's, I didn't see. What's the difference? The difference is I'm head on the outside and head on the inside. I'm not going to be this guy. That gives me time. Oh, oh, bap, oh, oh. Bap, kick, everything. Plus, okay. I got to run through this leg and through this hip just to take him down. Okay, okay. I got to go. Yeah. Boom. So, so, Vince, show me what you were saying. Drawing the leg back and then throwing with the right so hand or still throwing? I would be throwing with this hand, but I would be stepping this leg back. So, and especially against a wrestler, I want to be low. Like, I never want to be up here and trying to never. Shoot. Okay. Because I want to get put on my ass okay. never. 10 times. And that's the reason why Connor didn't kick as much. Yeah. You kick me, I'll stick to your legs. Right, right, I'm just, right. I'm just working to get a leg anyway. So anything that kicks, I'm just going, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whether I take it on or not, you know what I mean? So that's why the knees and the uppercuts are what he was working. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So I'm just staying really low, wide here, and I'm able to, as he starts to come in, step back and notice still in a great stance, low and wide, because if this guy, if I miss and this guy keeps shooting, then I can start sprawling, I can start moving my hips side to side, okay. trying to get away from him. Okay. There were times, as you saw in the fight, we, re we really remember that Khabib failed on, there, there were certain attempts that Khabib failed on, where kind of just hit him with the kind of salsa step and retreated bad. out of it. And that is, as a wrestler, the right way to go. And that's right. why I said, as footwork and as a wrestler from the perspective that I was looking, he did a good job of like having his defensive mindset of a wrestler. Well, you know yeah. why? He was watching your fight this video. That's right. That's what it was. It's, Connor's it's global. Was doing his homework. It's global. Yeah, tell, so. tell them the story. Apparently, I, when man, he was out getting his belt in Dubai, what happened? I was, out, I was walking in the mall, and a person came up to me and was like, oh, Bubba Jenkins. And I was just like, yeah. I'm Bubba J. And I'm like, yeah, I won the belt kind of thing. Like, yeah. Just, and they're like, no, I, I, you had a fight? What do you mean? I know you from Fight Tips with Shane Faison. I'm just like, but we're in the mall in Dubai and you know me from Fight Tips. And what that made me think is we, we need to go to Dubai. We, we, got, we, need, we hey, need to go back to Dubai. Fight Tips might be coming to Dubai. Ooh. Fight Tips might be doing a little tour. I mean, we might be coming. I might be fighting overseas sometimes, so we might just bring the boys with us. And oh, to a city near you. To a city near you guys. Cool. Or... or Whoever gets the more bang for the buck on the comments, we go there. <laughs> Whoever's got the most comments, we go there. Yeah, well. All right, guys. Tagging. Let's not forget the Hawaiian Islands. Oh, you got oh, it. Right. Right. You got yeah, it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Right. Well, I'm talking any place that says come through. Yeah. yeah. Any place that come says through. come through, we coming. We bringing the the new belts, the belts we got, the belts that's coming. We y'all say come through, we gonna come through. I'm telling you right now. There you have it, guys. Fight tips. That's your task. Comment down below. Where do you want us to come next? Until next time, be sure to subscribe and follow all these guys here. I'll even shine no beauty for you. We got Bubba Jenkins. <laughs> and beauty. And beauty. We got Vince the Anomaly. We got Coach PJ. Thank Links you. are all down in the description below. Until then, it's Fight Tips. Let's get it.